Everything can change in an instant. Whether or not you're ready. This wasn't the world I wanted, but it was the one I found myself in. This time I'm ready. Because I know war. War never changes. Welcome back to Fallout 4, boys and girls. Um, last time we ended uh, learning more about the Cabot family and the Cabot household and all that. And we are supposed to meet Jack at uh, Parson... because oh, my tongue. <laughs> Parson Asylum. And apparently Jack's father is uh, being held there because something is irregular about him. But before we go, I thought we would uh, explore a bit in the cabin house. There's no one here except for uh, Jack's mother. And uh, I think we want to have a little look around. See if we find anything interesting. I'm not going to ransack the place, but... Um, I did find a fat man here a second ago. I was just walking around here. Um, I'll just take what is. We'd move faster if you kept your eyes on the road and off me arse. Thank you, Kate, for that uh, vague image. Um, let's see. Anything there? I'll take that. I'll take that. Uh, we'll take any what we need at the moment. Well, technically, we don't actually need much here yeah, anyway. Um, we've got the kitchen. Storage. Okay, no, I'm not interested in that at the moment. We could always come back and I would say uh, raid the place a bit. But, let's check upstairs. Um, The terminal, does this terminal offer anything interesting? Got it. Well, that was a good case. Okay, different entries. Sure, going back 200 years or whatever. Let's see, the last one. But this is like a hundred odd years ago. Um, okay, so Jack has just been busy with Lorenzo's work. Let's see yeah, what it says. Something that wasn't possible in my first attempt, of course. Maybe I could have found some other artifacts that I could have studied more directly. Even if they were for completely different purposes, it would be invaluable in understanding how the artifact technology functioned. Okay, just end of that. Come on, you're wasting your time in that thing. Okay. Shut up! Where are you? You're not even in the same room. Zeta gun. Isn't this... Hmm. Interesting. Oh, Excellent. Oh. Maybe take the gun anyway. Uh, it's... What's down here? Um, I think we go upstairs. See anything interesting around here? Yeah? Okay, so that's one staircase we come up. Uh, we got the ammo, and there's anything I'm interested in there. Oh, there's the, the old lady sleeping. Okay, what do we have in here? Uh, magazine. What's this? Lorino Cabot Journal. Okay, let's just get the browse yeah. And the city's location is now safe with me until I can return and uncover more of the secrets when I am ready. Okay, well that's the end of it. So that's basically you kept the secret location of the city where you got the artifacts. And oops, wrong room. Let's see, anything interesting? Let's turn on this. 
There we go. I don't know how Jack keeps himself busy day after day. You'd think he would realize that it was hopeless by now after all these years and years. Maybe he's just going through the motions the way I am. Or maybe he's stopped trying to cure father. I mean, what happens after to us? I'm the only one that's ever tried to go without the serum, but Maybe Jack and Mother think they could just give it up, but I think they're fooling themselves. Okay, so that's probably the Slithers computer. Another interesting going on over there. So it's not much, yeah, it's a little bit of loot that you can get around walking around and getting things. Except for the magazine. Um, and a lot of law information. But I think we can come back and always check further at a later stage. But we need to get to that asylum and find out what's going on there first. Ready? Let's go. Just to be clear, under no circumstances oh. can we allow Lorenzo to be freed from Parsons. I would have lost my father forever. I refuse to let that happen after spending so long trying to cure him. Sure, I didn't even know you were standing outside yet, Jack. I thought, oh, okay, I'll take a walk to the Parsons. It's the artifact that's made Lorenzo mm -hmm. so dangerous. I'm sure his psychosis would be cured if it could Playtime. be removed. So far, all my attempts have failed. It's fused too tightly with his nervous system. That must have hurt. Eh, there's that big ship we still need to come check out. And we've got I'm well aware of the apparent conflict of interest in my father being the source of the treatment. That is prolonging my own life. Where but I have... assure you, if I had the chance, I would gladly give it all oh, up to have my really. father back. I heard you even for a short time. These fellas. Time to start looking for some goodies. I actually haven't even been into Bunker Hill yet. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Oh, yeah, Hmm, so I got a choice. Do I release Lorenzo, free him, or don't I? Because it seems like that is what it's going to come down to. Ah, uh, submutants. Sorry, Super Mutants, we are kind of in a hurry. Yeah, here's one of my settlements over here. County Crossing. Jack, you are very slow. Hmm. 
And looks like we're going past all the favourite tourist locations. No, I don't know what I just got XP for. Getting lag spikes. Hold up. You hear that? Hate being messed with like this. Hmm. Let's see, a military checkpoint of some sort. Let's see if there's anything in here. Oh, here's a, a bit of armor here we can take. So, Kate. Hey. What is it? Yep, I've got it. You can take the armor. I don't want the armor. Now, Jack has gone ahead. Okay, well there we go. Got some more armor. We can drop off at home. And this is a long walk. Jack, where are you walking around? How far is this place? Jack, you don't want to go in there. Where is this? Why are you going to Sorgus Ironworks? This place is right over there. Kate, how did she get down there that quick? Why did you guys have to go through the, that place? I'm sure you could have gone around it. And yeah, we've got the slog right nearby us. Um, where is Parsons? Is to my left. Where is Jack? Taking his sweet time now. Hi, how are you? I'm okay yourself. Okay, well, there's the sign up now. <coughs> I suppose I'm just gonna swim across. Is 
that looks like Jack coming across there. <coughs> Because he's taking way too long to get you. Uh, well, there is that other lady. The one who was in charge. Oh, raiders and gunners lying all over the place. Seems there was a big fight over here. Hmm, interesting. Come on, Jack, where are you? Have a minute? Got something on my mind. Oh, now you want to discuss something. Of course. Anything you need. Anything I need, huh? I might take you up on that one day. After Tommy stuck me with you, I was expecting to hate your guts. Not only Would because you, you agreed to, to pick up me contract, but because I was waiting for you Not to order me around like hired help. Now, so far, you've been treating me like a friend. Hell, you've been damn near nice to me. Okay, now, I don't mean to sound ungrateful, to both of you. but your kindness is starting to make me wonder if there's anything I learned in the combat zone. It was that nobody does things for other people without expecting something in return. What exactly do you think I'm expecting in return? Who knows? Doing your laundry, taking a bullet for you, hauling your gear. What's the difference? I don't think I'm getting through to you. Let me explain what I mean, then maybe you'll understand where I'm coming from. I spent three years living at the combat zone. Smelled like puke and piss, but I called it home. I was making a few caps, had my own bed to sleep in, and three hot meals a day. Then the raiders took over the place. You know that lot. They aren't exactly what you'd call the gentle type. After they moved in, if you didn't keep looking over your shoulder, you were liable to get sucker punched or robbed. Or worse. Didn't take me long to learn that I had to put my hard-earned caps to good use. Buying friends was essential to making life easy. So, I guess I'm waiting for you to hand me a bill. You know what I mean? You don't owe me a thing. Now I'm having a real hard time believing that. I'll tell you what. Give me some time and I'll think of something I can do to repay you. I'm not a rich girl, but I'm sure we can agree on something. After all, what are friends for? Okay, that was confusing and obviously Jack has gone inside. The door is blocked from the other side. I don't like admitting we'll it. Have to find a way this, if you think this is bad, you should see some of the blokes I beat up at the combat zone. Chained on the other side. Gotta be something of value hey. on him. Okay, well, we don't need loot at the moment. Who's there? Hey, what? Jack. Shit, we need to get to my office. Nothing there now. Shoot him! Shoot him all! <laughs> Someone there? Swore I heard something. We already killed everybody else. Why not you? No! No! Okay, that was gross. Okay, Jack, I suppose you are getting away. Where are my property? I can you, do this, this is my property! You know I have to show a girl a good time. Anything interesting? Made a big mistake, rookie! Damn. Did someone drive a bulldozer through here? Now, how would you know what a bulldozer is? Where's Jack? He just keeps going. Here. 
do this more often. Did Jack just throw that guy with one arm? Two shot handmade rifle. Okay. That's something interesting. <coughs> Oh wait, hold on, get out of that. We'll explore this place at a later stage. Come on, Jack, where are we going? Where are we going? Oh, well, I'll take it. That's the chain door. Yep. Okay. Edward! How badly are you hurt? I'm not dead yet. But I don't think I can get up. You kept them from using the elevator? Yeah. I... I sent the elevator down to the basement like you wanted. Looks and like shut someone it down. had a bad day. Oh. Shot quite a few of them before they decided to leave me alone in here. <sighs> Haven't seen anybody for quite a while. I think. It's hard to keep track of time. Are you sure you can't get up? I could really use your help. Yeah, Jack. I'm pretty damn sure. Well, then don't worry about it. Me and your friend here will have to take care of things ourselves. They've definitely reached the basement. Although I don't understand how they knew... Yes. Hey, Paul made. ...how to get past the... It doesn't matter now. We'll have to go through the abandoned part of the building. It looks like the Abremelin field is still functioning. Although several of the security doors in the basement have already been breached. We'd better hurry if we want to stop them. They seem determined to reach Lorenzo for some reason. Okay. Got it. Let's go. Just follow my instructions and everything will be fine. Be careful, Jack. You too. Okay, and now wait to. Someone there? Hey. Get some motherfucker! Yeah, these guys are tough, eh? Okay, which way? Where's Jack? Kate, you're blocking the entire path. Ouch. Got a minute? If they manage to free Lorenzo before I can stop them, it's not worth thinking about. Okay, well, let's get going and stop sitting on the floor. Oh, where do we go? Yeah. Uh, combat knife. Gotta be something of value on him. Is this the way we go? No. Come on, Jack. Which way do we go? <coughs> Oh, it's a pain waiting for NPCs to do something. We never used this wing. Nobody's been in here for decades. There's no telling what we'll run into. What do you mean you got like some monsters hiding away or what? Oh, 
mess. Let's hope we can find a way through. The utility elevator is on the bottom floor. Something isn't Come right. On. We should get out of here. I see what that was. So, you you're mine now, rookie. rookie. Whatever. Yeah. You're right. Just leave me this alone. This is gonna be fun. I need some goddamn power. Don't you die on me. Okay. Oh, I've got a lot of exploring and Drop things to check already. when I get to late, that later stage. Raiders, actually, you know. We don't have time for this. Give up now, I'll make it quick. Okay, we'll take it. This is the way. I don't like this. Not I one was bit. Thinking the same thing. How many are there? Good. The old utility elevator is still working. I take it we go inside. I'll get it. Don't Come on, it's the only way down. No music. Okay, Jack, wait Kill to next. everyone you see. Don't hesitate. We can't let them release Lorenzo. Hey, grip on yourself. Huh? Here and shit. Four of them. End of the line. Ah! You know what a weird place. We're going on in a mental hospital. All Could those assholes upstairs, and they still can't stop these clowns from barging in here. Come on, damn you, get that door open. Those idiots are trying to shut down the Abremelin field. That's the only thing keeping Lorenzo from breaking out of there. We need to get in there and stop there's them. A button that Hello, can Jack. Here. It's been a long time since I've had the pleasure of a personal visit. Father, I will stop this. My powers have grown, Jack. The artifact still has so much to teach me. Once I am free, I will be happy to teach you, too. You know I can't let you out until I can remove the artifact. Let me see. Lucifer's balls. They've locked down all the security doors. I'll have to open them one by one from here while you work your way down the hallway. Quickly now! That's right. Okay. You need to shut down the containment field in order to open the door. Shit, they're breaking through the security doors! Hurry it up! You've almost I'm got it. the main door. Hmm. Hurry! This is gonna get into the Killer! What the fuck is that? the simplest on the I can feel my strength returning. Now, I will finally leave. There's still one chance. I just need a moment to enter the failsafe codes. It's not too late. It will take some time for him to regain his powers. We still have a chance to stop him. Don't listen to my son. He's the crazy one. You know this. 
Look at what he's done to me. I built a failsafe into the containment grid. Switched the four Abremelin generators to manual override, and I can flood the cell with a lethal dose of Zeta radiation. Do the okay. right thing. Open this door, and let me out. Two more to go. Hurry! We're running out of time. Do the right thing. Let me out uh, of here. Let's just do that. That's it! Don't worry. The Zeta radiation won't harm you. I'm sorry, Father. I did everything I could to avoid this. I believe I was close to finding a way to remove the artifact. Liar! And upon me here forever if you'd had your way, puny worm. <laughs> Do you truly think you have the power to destroy me? <laughs> Good. Goodbye, Father. Hmm. Okay, well, um, Jack, how do I get to Jack? Winds of suit. Find anything good on him? Only his suit. Is there anything special about his suit? Um, not really. Nothing special about it. Okay, how do we get out of here again? Hey. We didn't have any other choice, did we? What would he hmm. have done if he'd gotten free? Oh, he would have killed both of us. And then the rest of my family. And that would only have been the beginning. His crimes back when he was free. It was only because of my family's influence that he ended up here, rather than on death row. The world now, it's a world made for monsters. Nothing could have stopped him. No. Hmm. I've answered my own question. We truly had no choice. What now? I need to bury my father and shut down this place. I won't be back here again. Before you go, I couldn't have done this without your help. I think this is fair compensation. I won't be needing your services after this. Sure, okay, quite a bit of caps. You don't need me anymore. No. Without Parsons to run, I don't think I'll need such an extensive staff. Great. Thanks. One more thing. I've done so much research on the artifact. Hmm. I may be able to do something with it. Come back and see me at Cabot House in a week or so. All my research may not have been completely in vain. Okay, so in about a week we need to go see Jack again. And, um... Well, that's the end of the quest, I take it. Nothing else we can do here. There's nothing interesting lying around inside here, maybe? No? Okay, no. That seems that's going to be the end of that. Well, guys, that is the end of the... Cabot House drama. Uh, let's see if is there anything maybe that we can over here, here between Jack and his father. Let's see. What do you think, Jack? Excuse me. I only wish I'd been able to find some way to cure my father before it came to this, I still believe that with a little more time, I might have found some way to remove the artifact. But it doesn't matter now. Okay, well... The artifact's thing is still on his head, so you can't remove it. Well, then that's going to be the end of that. Well, guys, that's going to be it. Till next time, choose.